That was a very difficult conversation for me last night. And um, <clears throat> in, um, in credit to James and to the other players that were left out, their attitude in being with the disappointment they had was brilliant, you know, even, you know, feeling for me, knowing that that's a difficult call for me to make to them and they still want to play their part if possible in supporting the team going forward. So um, he really played himself into contention, I think. Maybe he was a bit further away from it at the start of the Rugby Championship Series. Played himself right up into contention. And so I just think the balance of the team we wanted meant that we needed just the two jump like line out orientated locks and, and we've got those. Oh, well, the whole the selection was based on all the four matches plus what we've seen in Super Rugby, plus a bit of history. You know, you add uh, you sort of weight everything according to to what you need and the balance you need of some guys in form, some guys still with improvements to make and try to get that balance right too. So we took a, we looked over the, the four games in the championship, all backed into Super Rugby and the Spring Tour of last year as well, and um, and we made the, the decisions that we feel give us the best balanced team for the draw that we have going forward. I suppose that you could always say there is a bit of a risk. We've got we feel we've got uh, enough backup that can cover in a short term situation, and we feel like we've got excellent cover outside of the squad there with both uh, James Hansen and Nick White um, in case we do get an injury. And I think that shows, the, I suppose, the trust I have in those players that if a player is missing and we have to make a change, then I believe in those players to come into the squad and do the job. What it, what it allowed me to do was, like I was saying before, was to have two two teams that, I can turn, that we can train accordingly and turn around according to the draw that we have too. So for the first part of the tournament. And that's that's the way I, I really thought about it. And I felt we needed to have the extra prop, of course. So uh, I felt that's the right balance for what we're, what we're going to do. You can't just go off the last memory. You know, I thought Nick did well in the, in the games he played and played himself into contention. We started the Rugby Championship Series with Will Genia and, and Nick Phipps. And, um, and Nick White played himself through Genia's injury. Nick White came into the squad, played himself into contention through his performances. And we believed in him, obviously, because and we still do, because we backed him to play in those matches off, both off the bench and then as a starter, had, had an opportunity. And, and again, I made the selections based off the totality of what I've seen throughout Super Rugby and then the previous tour as well. So just trying to get the right um, balance in the squad for the challenge that I think we're going to have um, in the UK and, the, and the, the pool we have, the draw we have. Look, I'm really proud of, of all the guys and, and all the work we've done so far and I, I believe strongly in everyone here today and, and just like Czech said, I also feel for the guys who have missed out. You know, there's been 50-odd guys involved in this uh, from the, when Czech took the reins and, and he's included everyone the whole way and, you know, we can only take 31 to the World Cup. So uh, the guys in this, in this event today are the guys who have got the opportunity now to go over there and represent uh, not just... Uh, the guys who have missed out with the whole country, you know, so that's a big responsibility and a big opportunity for us and we want to do it well.